What's up everybody, it's your boy Fit City. How are you guys doing today? I'm doing great, hope you are too. And the new APK for the Lace update is available. Update 0.111.2 is now in the APK Mirror store. You can just simply Google Pokemon Go APK Mirror and you can download it already. Um, and it's a pretty good update. Uh, the most important thing is the friends list update, so to speak, is uh, where you can actually, as you can see on the screen there, sort by nickname you can nickname trainers you can sort by name you can sort by pending gifts and then you can also sort by friendship level so it makes it super easy to figure out who is who by nicknames you can sort accordingly it makes it a lot easier for us to send gifts and figure out who needs gifts so all in all a very good update again you can download the apk at apk mirror now Let's get into this lucky stuff. You guys have probably been seeing it all over the web by now. What is this lucky Pokemon stuff? And let's just go over a background and then I'll give you my speculation on what it could be. And I think somebody, the graphic designer for, for the GoHub, Yaya, I think he's onto something. So we'll get onto that soon. Let's just go over the background. Okay, so I'm not going to read this entire article. I will always link it down in the description if you want to read it all, but we're going to go over it a little bit. Lucky Pokemon. Let's start with that. This is a look of what a lucky Pokemon looks like. It's got a really shiny background, so to speak. It says lucky Pokemon right there. If you look at the Pokedex, it will show how many lucky Pokemon you've caught of each type. And there's some kind of weird virus kind of look thing. I'm hinting something. Um, right there in the corner too. I don't know if that's actually part of the game, but lucky Pokemon, they take 50% less candy to power up at that certain level and 50% less Stardust to power up too. So, you know, when we hatch a Pokemon, they're level 20, it takes 2,500 Stardust to power it up. Well, it would only take 1,250 and it usually takes two candies. It would only take one. So it's 50% discount on both. And it seems like this is implemented with the trading system there's get times lucky received and set times lucky received so it looks like trading pokemon is the way to get these lucky pokemon and hopefully it increases the chance of their ivs going up instead of down uh, because it looks like the chances of getting a lucky pokemon from a fellow trainer through trades is going to be pretty rare anyway so the fact that it's rare and it should go up on IVs, I think that, I think it just makes sense. It just makes sense. So here's the updated picture. Um, this was just tweeted yesterday, or well, this was today, actually. Wow. Um, a, a shiny Pikachu, or excuse me, a lucky Pikachu and a lucky Chansey, and they were hinting trades. Now, this is in uh, Spanish, but they were basically saying, you know, who was your first trade? There was the most special moment, and there you go. Lucky Pokemon. So... I'm thinking it's going to be dropping tomorrow, Monday, uh, 723. Trainer Tips seems to say the same thing, so that's rather interesting. We'll go back to Lucky Pokemon in a minute in my speculation. Now, we got new berries. It's a new Pineapp Berry. It's a Silver Pineapp Berry. Now, I think there's three things that this could mean. One, it like triple or quadruples the amount of candy you get uh, once you give it to a Pokemon that you're trying to catch. Two, it just does double candy and double stardust it does both or three it's just double stardust so the fact that it's a new pineapple berry called silver pineapple probably is going to be triple or quadruple candy but i wouldn't throw it out the window that it could do double stardust as well because that's what pineapple berry does is double candy why not double stardust as well we still need more ways to get a bunch of stardust there is not enough in pokemon go now the selby encounter is ready to go uh, Crawlays did a live stream yesterday and found all this stuff in the first place and it seems like the Celebi quest lines are ready to go um, it's only a matter of time before it comes out my guess would be at the end of the month or maybe uh, shortly in August so uh, there's also some new features found the code we won't go over that so let's go ahead and go back to the lucky Pokemon and it goes through trading I don't know if you guys remember about the main series game but Yaya brought this point up do you guys remember the Pokerus virus? If you don't, let's read, courtesy of the IGN. Thank you for whoever wrote this article back in January 25th, 2017. Shout out to you. So Pokerus is a very useful and very rare virus in the Pokemon world. It is rare to get it in the wild, but it's easy to come by now that online trading is so easily accessible. Online trading is so easily accessible. So trading, keyword, 
trading, and that's how you get lucky Pokemon. And if you didn't know what Pokerus does, this virus will allow Pokemon to gain effort value so when it levels up, twice as fast as usual. It's the same thing as using a Macho Brace or other power item except the Pokemon doesn't have to hold an item and their speed will not be cut in half. So basically what the Pokerus virus does, in Pokemon Go that is, what it would do is when you're leveling up a Pokemon with Stardust, it goes, it, it's IVs kind of raise. You know what I mean? Because we don't, there's effort values in Pokemon Go, but they're set in stone. But if we increase those, that basically means you're increasing the IV of the Pokemon, making it better. And this is a still a fairly rare virus to get in the main series game, even through trading. But that's the one of the only ways you can get it. It was very hard to get a Pokerus uh, virus Pokemon in the wild. Uh, it says down here the virus is about three times as rare as a shiny Pokemon in the wild. So getting it from trading Pokemon Go is going to be a lot easier than getting it in the wild. But I guess a Go Plus can kind of help increase your chances, but not really. So that was Yaya's uh, speculation, his conspiracy, thinking that Pokerus is going to be the lucky Pokemon in Pokemon Go. And I think he's absolutely right. Absolutely right. Give him props to that. Props to Yaya. Smash that like button for Yaya hype. Uh, I think he's absolutely correct. 100%. I don't, I don't think anyone's been talking about this on YouTube. Um, I, Trainer Tips didn't mention it. Uh, I don't know if Reversal has or not, but I think this is one, without a doubt what it is. So lucky Pokemon are going to have higher IVs, uh, have a higher potential once you're powering up to increase in IVs. So that gets rid of a bunch of items maybe coming in the future to increase the IVs of the Pokemon. Hope you're hyped as much as I am because the lucky feature should be coming out tomorrow. Should be. Or sometime this week. <laughs> Just a disclaimer. But should be coming out tomorrow. I'm super pumped because the event ends tomorrow. The double uh, candy event ends tomorrow. So it makes sense for them to drop it shortly after. Uh, comment down below. Let me know what you think about the Pokerus virus. Do you think this is linked to lucky Pokemon? I sure do. And uh, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Be a part of the Fit City fam. I'm signing off. I'll see you guys in the next Pokemon Go video.